Hey guys, what's up in this game? We are back with another Walking Dead video, and today we will be playing the final season episode to suffer the children. So let's get into the video. Okay, so we met this guy who's dressed as a zombie, and AJ got shot. Huh? Oh, he's strong, AJ. Oh. Oh. Be strong, AJ. Oh. Get the shrapnel out. Me? I'll keep him still. Oh. This is not going to be good. Oh. AJ, I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. Be brave, AJ. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. Man. Trying not to be loud. It's okay, AJ. Just breathe. Put your hands there. Stop the bleeding. It's okay, AJ. He's just gonna catch you up. Yeah. That's enough. For now. Yeah. Oh, easy. easy. Yeah. Where's our stuff? My gun. We lost it, buddy. Yeah. Oh, listen, Violet Ran. Yeah. They're safe. Yeah, yeah let's probably. hope so. Let's hope so. It sucks. Yeah. But at least you're alive. Oh. Huh? Who is this guy? Come on, AJ. <laughs> So, who is this guy? I didn't mean to endanger you. The walkers were sent to help you. Hmm? You sent the walkers? Was part of a group. Called themselves Whisperers. Oh. They've learned to live in herds. Among walkers. Move among them. Sometimes. Guide huh. Them. Hmm. Why are you alone, if you were part of a group? They attacked a community, saw the carnage, mm. and didn't want to be part of it. Mm. Oh, does it hurt? Hungry. Eat. Both of you. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks, man. Hmm. Do you have a name? Been a while. Since. I've hmm. said it. Huh. Huh? Whoa. Whoa. James. Huh. Why did you help us, James? 
and the people who attacked you. What do you know about them? I hardly know anything about them. You know they attacked you. They'll attack again. Yeah, they said as much. Yeah. They're at war up north. Their entire community against another. Oh. It's why they take people. To make them fight. Train them. Use them. Like ten sisters. You join their war. Maybe, maybe his sisters are alive. Ten. Yes. That's why I helped you. Hmm. Thank you. Yeah. Huh? What's that? Wait. Throw it. Distract it. Works just as well. And nobody gets hurt. Not us. Not him. Okay. I trust you. Huh. Thank you. Yeah. Georgia. Georgia. Long mm. way from home. Yeah. It feels like forever ago. Yeah. It was. So, where are you from? Washington. Wow. The city or the state? The city. Dad ran a food truck. And I helped. Huh. You've got a fever. His wound right. will need proper cleaning and medicine. If you're lucky enough to have any. The school has medicine, but I don't think they'll share it. That's why those people attacked you, isn't it? To get to that school. They'll destroy whatever yeah. they find. Bring more guns, more fighters. Take everyone inside. Yeah. They won't be able to fight them off. It's gonna be okay, AJ. You need medicine. You have to go back, or you'll lose him. Mm. I'll go back. Convince them to help AJ. Yeah. They'll take us back once they see him. They wouldn't turn AJ away. Yeah. You hope? I'll help you get back. Past the walkers. A few more hours and we'll go. That's a few hours for Hopefully you to some of them will help. <sighs> I'll stay awake. You don't have to. Thanks, James. Sleep. I'll keep watch. <sighs> okay, I will. What about you? Don't need it. Not tonight. Rest she, well. She deserves some sleep. Good night.
I'm starting to like James, even though we just met. Whoa! Whoa! Thanks anyway, James. See ya. I can't keep carrying you. I'll be inside soon. Rest now. Yeah. I know you feel 
think I didn't do enough for you and AJ, but when I saw you were in danger, I had to do something. I wanted to help you, but when you told us to run, I had to trust you. Thank you for protecting us. It was really brave. I really thought you were dead, Clem. Yeah. It's just everything is so fucked right now, you know? Everyone is scared, Clem. It's really good to see you again. I thought you hated me. Well, maybe for a second, but not now. Yeah. It's good to see you too. Just wish Mitch and the others felt the same. Lewis and I told them what happened in the woods. That woman who attacked you, Lily. Yeah. So you do know her. We were wondering. Who the hell is she? I mean, I know you're not like with her group. We were Lily friends. Lily and I were friends a long time ago. Yeah. Friends? Back when the walkers first showed up, we lived in a motor inn. Survived really awful shit. Yeah. Lily tried to keep us all together. Yeah. Looks like she's changed. Yeah, seems that way. She murdered someone in our group, gunned them down during an argument. Yeah. Carly was her name. She refused to let Lily push her around. It was right at the start. I haven't seen Lily since. Yeah. I believe you. But... There's something else. Lily said someone was with you at the gates. James. He saved me and AJ. Let us stay in his camp for the night. Why yeah. did you bring him here? You led him right to us. I mean, he's a stranger, Clem. Running into those two in the woods, it proved we can't trust him. But you don't have to worry about James. We can trust him. Lily said he was wearing, I don't know, animal skins or something. He was wearing walker skin. That's how he gets past herds. Uh -huh. He can guide them, too. <sighs> wow. Okay. I wouldn't have brought him here if I thought he was a threat. It's not that I don't trust you. I'm just worried about the others and what they might do. Uh -huh. They didn't even get a chance to mourn Brody and Marlin before these child-snatching assholes showed up. Yeah. And then you two come back after we thought you were dead. Now they're confused and no one knows how to feel about AJ. Violet? AJ is the least of their worries. Yeah. I know, but everything is such a mess. They're scared and angry, and they're looking for someone to blame. I mean, they kicked you out. How am I supposed to make them change their minds about you? It was decided. Five to three against. I know it feels like it shouldn't matter, but they were afraid of you. Both of you. Oh my god, forget the stupid boat. It's not important now. Yeah. James told me what Lily and Abel will do next. He said they'll get more people and guns and come attack us. Take everyone here. Right. How the hell would he know? He's watched them for a while. They're at war with another community. They take people to fight for them. Is that what happened to Minnie and Sophie? They turn them into soldiers? Yeah, it'll happen to us too if we don't stop them. Mm. Minnie didn't even like killing walkers. this place. It's a fortress. With a little work, we could make this place really hard to attack. Do you actually know how to do that? Yeah, I was part of a siege once in a town called Richmond. Yeah. Here, let me show you. We've got good strong walls. We need to make them hard to climb over, so the raiders have to come in through the gates. We used to keep barbed wire in the greenhouse. The courtyard's pretty wide open, not a lot of cover. We should flip the picnic tables, narrow down the pathways through it, so we'll know which way they're coming. Yeah. At the very least, it'll give us protection if they get past these walls. This is where we should make our stand. There's only one way in, the front, and then there's the big central staircase. Mm. If we rig that path with traps, we can pull back here. Luring in our attackers. I like it. Mm. Well, you guys don't use the greenhouse anymore, do you? No, we used to. But we lost someone up there. 
walkers overran the place and Marlowe wouldn't let us go back. Safe zone. We need to get that barbed wire so they can't climb the walls. I'll go. Are you sure? It's gonna be swarming with walkers by now. Okay, what the hell's huh. going on? You told me she was back, but I was like, no way. Violet wouldn't just go against what we all decided. Shh, don't you keep it down? The little boy's asleep. His fever's already going down, Glenn. He's gonna be okay. Thanks, Rumi. Great. We're just giving them our medicine, too. Mitch, those raiders are getting ready to attack the school. We need Clem's help. Like hell we do. For all we know, she's one of them. She's not. If you saw their leader's boot on Clem's neck, you'd know that. Look, I understand you're angry that you lost a friend. But you have to trust me. If you don't, we don't stand a chance. I trust you to put a bullet in the back of my head. Mitch! What the heck, man? Clem's going to the greenhouse to find barbed wire and anything else she thinks we need for the fight, and you're going to help her. Uh, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. It's too dangerous for her to go by herself, and you're good in a fight. Hmm. I can go too. You know, to keep the peace. Okay. Fuck, Vi. Since when are you the one making the calls? Since no one else stepped the fuck up. Mm. These two will meet you at the gate, and you can head to the greenhouse once I've explained the situation. Okay. See you there. Ruby, I trust, because she's nice, but Mitch. I wonder how Richmond's doing. Guess I didn't realize how long it's been. How much it's changed. This ain't budging. You gonna stand there sulking all day? Or you gonna do something useful? Yeah. Oh, we need that barbed wire. There must be another way in. Because we're desperate, you know. So don't get comfy. If we survive these raiders, you and I are gonna have words. Let's survive first. Yeah. Hmm. That ladder could be useful. But let's. Talk to Ruby first before doing so. Are you okay? It's been so long since I was here. I used to love this place, but it's so overgrown. I'll be fine. Let's just find a way in. Okay. Send along we don't mind losing. 
That's an ugly thing to say. My son is going to need her help, right? She shouldn't mind sticking her neck out. I'll go first. I don't mind. Yeah. Figured you'd fight it. Thanks, Clem. Holler if one grabs you. Otherwise, okay. we'll come as soon as you get the all clear. I guess we'll know when the door opens. Ginger, Eastern prickly pear, Jerusalem artichoke, false Solomon seal. Let's find that barbed wire and anything else that might be useful. Yeah. You seem happy. You can only eat the same bland rabbit stew so many times before you go crazy. These yeah. herbs are going to do wonders for morale. You wait and see. Assholes try and climb our walls, they'll tear their guts out. Yeah. I kind of like to see that. <laughs> hmm? Pick up a mushroom. Some mushrooms are edible. something? Yep, maybe useful. Hmm? At least we got a chrome bar again.
from climbing our walls. Hey, we can use these. Uh, for what? Hmm. We can make bombs out of these. Bombs? Cool. Are you serious? Totally. It's the kind of stuff I made back home. Huh. He used to blow shit up. That's why he's a troubled youth. Guilty. <laughs> I just need some propane and something to create a spark. And we'll have ourselves a nice little homemade <laughs> explosive. That would be cool. Okay, let's see what's inside. Yeah. Oh! Oh!
thinking? You find anything? I actually I don't know what this is. Huh? What's that? Hopefully, ain't you so okay. bombs. In my first one when I was eight. Huh. Really? I blew up the garage. It was awesome. <laughs> Though, Dad didn't think it was awesome. <laughs> Dad gave me a chemistry set to keep me from fighting the neighbors. Uh, why would you fight the neighbors? I had a lot of energy. I had to use it somehow. And they didn't like my face. Oh, wait. Let's hope there's gas in it. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Here. Come on, man. Good find. We got the propane. Yeah. Now if we could just find something to create a spark. Hmm. Hopefully that's what we need. A Venus fry trap. Huh. Better take that. Uh, Mitch, is this useful? Fucking A. I was hoping there'd be one of those. That's an igniter. We can use it to create a spark. It's the last thing we need to blast those motherfuckers to hell. We should get back and tell the others. Not until we bury Miss Martin. Bury her? Why bother? It's a walker. Help me drag it out back. You can burn it. No. Miss Martin's the reason we're all alive. Why can't and she deserves a proper burial? Yeah. Here. Next to the greenhouse she loved. That way the others won't have to see her like this. She's been dead for years. There's no point. Okay. I'll help you bury her. It's the right thing to do. For someone you cared about. Yeah. Thank you so like much. Like AJ saying. It's not a her. It's a walker. Like AJ said, you've been Fine. Walkers. Whatever. I'm not wasting my energy on that thing. I'll put a stone in the graveyard. Back at the school. But Ms. Martin loved this place. She'll be happy here. Yeah. I'll make sure everyone knows you helped me. That you've got a a good heart. Yeah. Under all that muck. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> See you, Miss Martin. Think it'll be enough? Hopefully. It means Lily and her people won't be able to climb the walls. Yeah. We'll have to come through the gates. We can plan for that. Straight into a fiery explosion of death. Assholes won't know what hit him. Yeah. I'm going to end the video here. So anyway guys, if you did enjoy this episode, please don't like and subscribe. But until next time guys, I'll see y'all later. Peace out.